Well, this Thursday is Art Walk, and the National Center for Children's Illustrated Literature is opening a new exhibit featuring artist Christian Robinson. And here to tell us more is Tris Dressen. Thanks so much for being here today. Thanks so much for having having me. It feels <laughs> weird to be out and about. But I know. I'm very, I'm very grateful. Thank you. Awesome. So last time we talked to you, you guys had to kind of throw an egg exhibit together with yeah. Encore. Tell us a little bit about this one coming up. So this is our first show um, in 11 months that we've opened because of COVID. Um, so we're very excited about it. His name is Christian Robinson. He's an international award-winning children's picture book artist. Um, he's a very, he's an emerging young artist, but what I think one of my most favorite things about him is that he actually has more work than most um, professionals that have been in this industry for uh, double his lifespan. He's a hard worker, he's incredibly talented, and his art is just Studying. We're so proud of this exhibition and so excited to have people back in our space. I'm sure. How long did it take to put all of this together? So every exhibition takes about two years um, to, to coordinate. Again, these are national and international artists. Um, the Nickel is so fortunate to Abilene as a whole is so fortunate to have the National Center here. So we get to work with um, tremendous international and, and national artists from all over. So it takes about two years to wow. to get the exhibition up. So can we see some of the artwork yes. that he has? So, so this is, um, again, because of COVID, I feel like everyone has to preface everything mm -hmm. with because of COVID. Mm -hmm. um, Christian isn't able to come this time. Okay. Um, but the exhibition is still going up as scheduled on October 8th. And so we're doing things a little bit differently for the opening. Instead of being in our art studio and our art space, we're having take and make um, art projects at home using the same fine art mediums that Christian uh, Robinson uses, painted acrylic and collage. So each of these have things that Christian um, would have used in his own work that you then get to create at home. In addition, we'll have um, some special messaging from Christian. We'll have a socially distanced um, members reception from four to six during art walk and then from six to eight uh, we'll have we'll continue with live music and art activities and just a real celebration of of his life's work right here in Abilene. What does it mean for y'all to actually be able to open doors finally and get people back in? Jessica are you trying to make me cry? I'm sorry. I I'm I, sorry. I, I wasn't <laughs> going to. Um, it it has been so difficult not to have people in our space because you see how transformative art can be, particularly in times of stress um, and, and times of anxiety, which I think everyone has felt the last few months. So I'm, I'm so excited. My staff is so excited. Our board is so excited. Christian is excited and devastated <laughs> that he's not gonna be able to come, but maybe when things calm down a little bit, he'll be able to come and and see his exhibi exhibition in our gallery, but we're just so excited. And again, all of our programming is free, meaning everyone has access to these experiences, um, whether it be perusing the art gallery or taking part in some of our programming. Well, thank you so much for coming on. And again, Art Walk is this Thursday. If you want to see the exhibition, it will be at the National Center for Children's Illustrated Literature, which is located on 102 Cedar Street. The exhibit will be on display October 8th through January 29th. For more information, you can call 673-4586 or go to thenickel.org.